Thank you, Lexi. In this week's Minute with Drexel, Drexel talks about accomplishing those big goals a lot of us have in life. Hey, y'all. I saw a wall hanging this week that said, if you take care of the little things in life, the big things will take care of themselves. Well, I don't know if that's completely true, but I do believe the thought has some merit. I mean, I think we spend so much time worrying about the big things in life that we don't take as much time and care with those things that we label as little. For instance, how about getting up a few minutes early every day and spending those few minutes in prayer or thought or simply organizing the day? Those few little minutes could go a long way to taking the stress out of that big day ahead of us. How about turning off the television for a few minutes and spending that time playing a board game or a card game with our kids, our grandkids, our spouse, our friends. Those few minutes that we sacrifice might go a long way toward putting something very, very special into our big relationships. How about not telling those little white lies? I know it can be tempting, but those little mistruths can add up and can go a long way towards taking a big hit and our reputation. In the New Testament, Jesus stressed the importance of taking time and care with the little children and of having a simple faith just the size of a tiny mustard seed and of taking the little that we are given and turning it into something bigger and better for ourselves, but also for others. Why don't you join me this week in listing the so-called little things in our lives that might be going awry and see if we are taking as much time and care with them as we should be, and if not, to find ways to do so. Perhaps if we do that, those big things that we worry so much about, our stress, our relationships, our reputation, might begin to take care of themselves. And that's your Minute with Drexel.